สวัสดีค่ะ How are you doing today? Today we're going to be bringing you some um, a vegan dish. Actually, it's a pad kimao, the drunkard's noodles. So um, this time we're going to be doing it vegan. So we're going to be using the tofu, and then the um, this is the Chinese Chinese broccoli, regular broccoli, carrots, and then I'm going to show you the two different kinds of basil. Um, the one we're going to use for the drunkard's noodles. Is actually this. This is called holy basil. Holy basil. This is the spicy basil. And this is your Thai sweet basil, the normal one that you usually get in the store. A lot of times you'll see it got a purple stem. We grow both at home, so um, that's why it looks a little bit uh, less big, so you can see the difference. The Holy basil has got a little bit more rounder leaves and jagged edges, but the sweet basil has got the more pointed at the end. So now you see the difference. If you can't get this one, which is really hard to get, then you can just go ahead and use the sweet basil. And the noodles, it is the, the fat rice noodles. And you can also use this one, it's the dry one. The dry one, all you got to do is soak it for 10 minutes in hot water and then drain it and then you're ready to go. So this is a dark soy or black soy. This is a healthy boy mushroom soy. And this is soy seasoning by Sunly. This one is also uh, gluten free too. And then since uh, we don't use oyster sauce in the vegan dishes, we're going to use a little bit of hoisin. Hoisin kind of gives it that savory kind of flavor, like the oyster sauce. So, here we go. Gonna put a little bit of oil, just enough to coat the bottom of the pan. Then we're gonna brown our tofu a little bit. So all this is doing is taking out some of the water and kind of firming it up so that you don't get so much breakage of the tofu when you stir fry it. One thing with delicate items in your stir fry is if you can stir it less, you get less breakage. Even the noodles here, if you Using the fresh noodles, if you just warm it up for about two minutes in the microwave oven, it'll become more soft and pliable, and then you won't have to mix it so much. And um, when you mix it too much, what happens is you get like short noodles. So if you want long noodles, then you have to kind of warm it up in the microwave before. So as you can see, the tofu is picking up this nice little light brown color, taking out a lot of the, the excess water. Once that happens, you can go ahead and add your vegetables. Again, 
the type of vegetables that you use is totally up to you. You can add more, you can less, your favorite vegetables, if you stuff like onions and celery and all that, you can add that to that. Right? So the color of your broccoli is a good gauge on how much you want to cook it. Um, once the broccoli gets with a nice deeper green color, then you know that it's So if you can see, the broccoli has picked up a darker green color and it's a little bit um, soft, then you know that it's ready to add the noodle. Now I'm going to add a little bit of uh, hoisin here, just a little bit. But first I'm going to add the soy. We just go with five. And then a the little bit of dark soy. And then the hoisin. Yes, the dead. And this is just plain sugar. This is just plain sugar. Just a little bit. So the soy and the sauces help you break up the noodles to separate them. Oops, <laughs> a live noodle. And this is just a little bit of water. Once the noodles is all about separated, you're all about ready to go. And then all you do is add the basil in at the end. I'm used to cooking this in a big wok. <laughs> then you smell that essence of the basil. The basil, this spicy basil, basil has got like a a little bit of a, like a peppery anise type of smell. Very distinct over the, the rest of the basil. And once that's done, you're all done.
Now, we didn't make it spicy, but normally Pachimau has got a little bit of spice to it, so. Anything? Spicy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, once again, that's the, the drunkard's noodles, and that's the vegan style. So everything that we use here has no animal products whatsoever. So just go ahead and try it and see if you like it. Anyway, thank you for tuning in. Please subscribe. Hit the button on the bottom there. And... Um, just to let you know, it, there's no cost to subscribing. Subscribing is free, and it just lets you know when we post a new video. Visit us on Facebook. The recipes will be there. And if you got any questions or need any advice, contact us. Again, try cooking Thai. Until next time. Cooking Thai. Take it easy. <laughs>